all of a sudden we recognize the health of our fellow man or our community actually affects our own health. I think we need to absolutely look, and in fact it is, that health care is not just health care, it's actually health. Dr. Patrick Soon-Shong is executive chairman of Abraxas Bioscience and CEO of Abraxas Health. A gifted surgeon and a visionary entrepreneur, Dr. Soon-Shong is forging a new paradigm for healthcare delivery through his innovations in cancer research and treatment. Patrick Soon-Shong was born in apartheid South Africa to Chinese immigrant parents who fled from China during World War II. He graduated from high school at age 16 and became a doctor by 23, earning his medical degree from the University of the Witwatersrand in Johannesburg, South Africa. He later earned a Master of Science from the University of British Columbia. Then he moved to the U.S. to begin his surgical training at UCLA. In 1986, he performed UCLA's first whole organ pancreas transplant, which was a radical and successful surgery for something usually treated with insulin. He went on to perform in 1993 the world's first encapsulated islet transplant in a diabetic patient, allowing the patient to stay off insulin for an entire month. His continued research for the treatment of critical illnesses led to the co-invention of Abroxane, America's first nanoparticle approved for breast cancer, in which it doubled the response rate and, remarkably, has now shown complete responses in pancreatic cancer. Dr. Soon Shong is a co-inventor of over 50 issued U.S. patents, has published more than 100 scientific papers, and is founder of two publicly traded multi-billion dollar pharmaceutical companies, American Pharma Partners and Abraxas Bioscience. He has devoted his career to developing the next generation of biotechnology and believes in the power of health information exchange. He has donated $1 billion to create the Bell Labs of Healthcare which is an information superhighway where doctors and medical professionals can share information in real time. I believe the most important thing we need to do is to create a public utility of information exchange, truly for the common public good. The patient's life uh, sitting on the table really is a reflection of an amazing amount of team effort going on in real time. Dr. Soon Shon's belief that everyone should have access to quality health care led him and his wife Michelle to donate more than $100 million to establish the Chan Soon Shang Center for Life Sciences at St. John's Health Center in Santa Monica, and the Center for Health Informatics, which brings together the computer scientists from UCLA, USC, the Argonne National Laboratory at the University of Chicago, and St. John's Health Center to address the complex problem of health care integration. And Patrick Soon Shong's commitment to healthcare works for immediate goals, too. His recent announcement guaranteeing $100 million to reopen Martin Luther King Hospital near Watts ensures that the region's underserved citizens will also receive quality health services. His commitment to advancing medical technologies doesn't stop there. Dr. Soon Shong was recently appointed chairman of the Life Sciences Steering Committee for the X Prize Foundation an educational nonprofit prize institute dedicated to fostering radical breakthroughs for the benefit of humanity. Earlier this year, he was appointed the executive director of the UCLA Wireless Health Institute, a community of experts focused on improving the reach of healthcare through wireless technologies. He was also appointed to the board of Fair Health, a newly formed organization that will collect and distribute health insurance company reimbursement rates allowing patients to know in advance what insurers will cover for out-of-network health care services in their area. I think a lot of doctors deserve to be on the 400, but they don't have the opportunity to take their entrepreneurial spirit and actually get the appropriate funding. Dr. Soon Shong epitomizes the entrepreneurial spirit on which Los Angeles was built and the success that can be achieved through hard work and perseverance. The companies he founded have created hundreds of jobs for Los Angeles County, and the life-giving research and technologies developed under his leadership have helped to save countless lives. He is leading the nation in transforming health care, creating unrivaled opportunities for our region, and is establishing us as an industry leader in the life sciences.
the LAEDC is proud to honor Dr. Patrick Soon Xiong with its 2009 Eddie Award for his role in the advancement of the bioscience industry in Los Angeles County and for his unwavering commitment to LA County through his philanthropic contributions, medical advances, and economic leadership.